What is up you guys? Welcome to Totally Trendy. Before you say anything, I know I say this at the beginning of every video, but it's true, I am really excited for today's video because food, I mean, that, that's all it takes really. Now, I have a few vegans in my life and it's 2019, so odds are you do too. You probably know a vegan or a vegetarian. Like I said, 2019, we're living in the future. Personally, I'm not a vegan, but I do try and shop vegan and eat vegan sometimes because I think it's good for the environment, but we don't have to get into that. In this video, I am going to be taking some items around to my coworkers and having them guess if it is vegan or real. We're gonna do a blindfolded taste test. This video is happening because Carl's Jr. just recently announced that they are selling Beyond Burgers. If you don't know what a Beyond Burger is, it is a plant-based burger. And I have had them before, but typically I've only had them at like really fancy fancy restaurants and they taste amazing like they taste like a burger I know if you haven't had one you probably won't believe me but they really do and I think it's awesome that a fast food place is now selling Beyond Burgers I have Beyond Burgers and regular burgers I'm gonna be setting the Beyond Burger and a regular cheeseburger also from Carl's Jr. in front of said contestant they will be blindfolded they will do a taste test and tell me which one they think is real and which one they think is the vegan option I'm also gonna do this with ice cream and butter we are gonna work our way up to the Beyond Burger, so we're gonna save those for the finale. But let's get started. Real versus vegan. Yeah. Yay. How you don't seem excited. I've never tried vegan food, and I'm really nervous for it. Wait, really? Yeah. Do you have fruit? Yes. That's yeah. okay. Well, that's a good point. Okay, so I'm gonna. You're gonna be blindfolded for this. Oh. Okay. okay. I'm gonna be presenting you with two different things. Okay. You will taste them both and tell me which one you think is the real one and which one you think is the vegan version. Okay. You wanna know something crazy? When I was yes. little, I had a vegan hot dog before and I uh -huh. didn't know it was a vegan hot dog and I threw it. Fun fact. But now I'm I like sorry. vegetables. I'm sorry to hear that, dude. So, so let's try it. Yeah, okay, let's try it. All right, let me prepare these for you. I'm so nervous. I have an actual blindfold if you need it for the rest of the day. I thought about asking people, but nah. You should have. This is gonna be a butter taste test. A just, you butter know, taste I, I wanted you to like be aware of the fact that it was butter. I'm just putting a small, small amount. You can have more. Oh, I'm just eating butter. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Okay. That's why it's a small amount. So just you know, the one that's going in your right hand is a knife. And then this one is a spoon. They were the last utensils we had in the okay. kitchen. So do whichever one you want to do first and tell me which one you think is the real butter. And which one is vegan? Okay. <laughs> Thoughts? Comments? Concerns? Ooh, that's gonna be rough. I think the one on the spoon was a vegan one. You are wrong. Really? The, yeah, the one on the spoon was real butter. The one on the knife was completely vegan butter. That is crazy. The vegan one was uh -huh. really salty. They salt that. Do you have underwear on your head? It kind of looks like it, doesn't yeah. it? It's your mom's. Yeah. Rose is on her way over right now. She actually just went live with Dope or Nope. And I am preparing all of the food items that she's gonna eat. And I'm excited to get her reactions. Hey, do you ever just show up to your friend's office and think, you know what's gonna be fun today? Getting blindfolded. Have I got the place for you? Common office at High Five Studios. Hello. You're blinding me with that? That's like an entire outfit. Well, one of the food things is mm -hmm. gonna be vegan and the other is gonna be real. Interesting. So you're gonna have to guess which one is vegan and which one is real. I think the only thing I've ever had that's vegan is donuts. I've had a vegan donut one time. Okay. And it was cool. actually really good, surprisingly. Yeah. Sam, maybe next time think, just consider getting an actual blindfold. Connor said the same thing. He has a blindfold, but I just didn't want to walk over there and get it. Ah, <laughs> I'm having a hard time. I know this is probably gonna look a little sus, but it works. I got this! You're gonna- No! This first round is butter. Okay. And one hand is a spoon, and then in the other it's a knife, so be careful. <laughs> oh, this is hard. Oh, I don't want to eat butter. Okay. Imagine it's on like toast or something. Connor just went for it. That's butter. That's butter for sure. Okay. Oh, that one's salty. <laughs> it's just salty. <laughs> is that one Thoughts, vegan? Thoughts, comments, concerns, complaints? Knife vegan? Yeah! Knife vegan. Okay, so you got one right. Next up, ice cream. Ooh, yes please. There are two different bowls, so just kind of feel around for which one you want to try first. Okay. Oh, there was nothing in that spoon. All right, and then here's the other one. Feels like ASMR. <laughs> this was the vegan one. Ding, ding, ding. Nice. 
What gave it away? The Oreos. Yeah. Well, they were both cookies and cream flavored. The vegan one tasted like salted caramel. Oh. All right. Well, one point for you. Yes. Does ice cream sounds fun? Frick yeah, it does. Can I say that? Yeah. Frick yeah. Okay. Ice cream. Cookies and cream. Go for it. Okay. No, oh, this is hard. <laughs> mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's pretty good. That's one of my favorites. Cookies and cream. Solid stuff. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that one's vegan for sure. Really? Yeah. How could you tell so quickly? Like, what was the difference? It almost tasted like there's like coconut milk instead Wait. of regular milk. Mm, yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Freaking nailed it. I'm yeah. a chef. Okay, now this one, this is a big one. Carl's Jr. Ooh. now sells Beyond Burgers. Oh, no. Completely plant-based burger. I've been really curious about this. Isn't it okay. like the same amount of calories, though? Same amount of calories. It actually has more protein than a real burger. You know how I like my protein. Let me prepare it for you. Okay, I'm gonna try this one. Okay. Collecting thoughts, mm -hmm. collecting thoughts. Okay. All right, and then here's the second one. Carl's Jr. burgers was, aren't good. Was there onion on that? Yeah. Oh. I think there's like, oh, sorry. There's everything on them. I can tell you're That's the Beyond so Meat one. You sure? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. Yeah. yeah. Could you tell a drastic difference? This one has flavor. Carl's Meat Burgers oh, don't have flavor. Interesting, interesting. Carl's Meat Burgers, meat like literally doesn't have any flavor. And the Beyond one does? It has flavor. It's an interesting flavor, not yeah. bad. Oh, it looks like an actual patty too. Interesting. Isn't it weird that like that's plants? No, because like, plants are it's, beautiful. It's Sam. hard for me to wrap my mind around that, but that's interesting. You're more though. advanced than I am. That's always been my problem with Carl's Jr. Burgers is that they're not, they don't taste good. Oh, interesting. Yeah, the Beyond Meat one had flavor to it. Yeah, I would, liked it. Would you eat it again? Yeah. Now this is a pillow. Is the big one burgers? Oh no. Yeah. Oh no. yeah. Burgers from Carl's Jr. They have a vegan burger at Carl's Jr. Yeah. What? That's what inspired this video because I was out weird. to lunch and saw that they started selling Beyond Burgers, 100% plant-based meat. Wow. It has like everything on it. I hate mayonnaise, but it's fine. Sorry. Here we go. A big bite. Mhm. Mm mmm. -hmm. She goes. Mmm. Mmm. Ready? Mhm. Mm Here, I'll get you. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. That's mayonnaise. I hate mayonnaise, too. I'm mm. so sorry. It's all right. Ugh. This is a real burger, for sure. Gonna do it? Wow. Really? No. I mean, you got it right. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> yeah. What was your opinion? Like, what, what were the main differences that I think you could... this one's just a little more, like, dry. And it's not as, like, juicy. Okay. Honestly, I would eat that. Like, it doesn't taste bad. It doesn't... It kind of tastes like meat, which is weird. Yeah, so that that was my second question is... It would totally you think like that meat. it was meat? Yeah, if it was a little bit juicier, I probably wouldn't know the yeah. difference, honestly. But you see, plants aren't that juicy. No. Plants are not. Guys, for this next one, I'm gonna be bringing in CJ from Battle Universe. But here's the thing, he's a vegetarian, so I'm not gonna make him taste the real burger, but he doesn't know that I got Beyond Burgers. So with him, it's gonna be a little special. I am just gonna do the burger taste test with him, and I'm just gonna give him the Beyond Burger. So this is not mean, but I'm not gonna tell him what I'm giving him. I'm just gonna put a blindfold on him and be like, oh, eat this and see what happens. Oh, CJ. Hi. You want to get blindfolded? Mm, yeah. Go ahead and take a seat right there. Uh, don't mind just if chill. I do. Please just uh, trust me. That's not a blindfold. <laughs> this is how, okay. This is the scary. I have a uh, blindfold if you need one. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Where am I? <laughs> Let me go get it. Okay. So I'm gonna grab the burger right now and he is unsuspecting. So that is noise. Also, side note, do not play this prank on a vegetarian or a vegan with real meat. That is when it is wrong. Okay, I lied a little bit. Well, put the bag over your head. Okay. This is how horror movies start. What? What'd you do at work today, honey? Oh, you know, put a bag over my head, trusted Sam with my life. So CJ, hey. we are going to be doing a taste test. Taste test. Okay. So I have some food for you here. Okay. And you are going to tell me if this is cheap or expensive. Cheap or expensive. Cheap or expensive. Go for it. Three, two, one, go. Sam? You're not like a vegetarian or anything, right? Is this a burger? Well, Samantha, okay. How does it taste? Tell me how it, it tastes. It tastes like a burger. I don't <laughs> eat meat. This is not cool. Is this a burger? I, I mean. It, I tried it really tight. <laughs> CJ. It's not a burger. I don't believe you. I mean, that is a burger. So it is it's a burger. It's been two years. It I haven't eaten meat. But it is a burger, but it's not meat. 
That right there is a 100% plant-based burger really? from Carl's Jr. Really? Carl's Jr. Oh, is this the Beyond Meat burger? Yeah, it's Beyond Meat. OMG, this is so good. My heart dropped <laughs> yes. a little bit. I'm sorry. <laughs> Holy I'm sorry. moly, biting into it, tasting like that charred taste. I was like, oh, this is a burger. <laughs> I, I'm not a bad person. Oh my gosh, that's so good. Isn't it? Do I get to keep this? Yeah, you can take it. Yes, this is so good. Honestly, like, this is like better than any veggie burger that I've had. And I yeah. actually can't believe that it's from Carl's Jr. I love that they sponsored. have them now. By the way, this video is not sponsored. That's crazy. That's so good. You actually scared me like really good. This is really good. Yeah. Though, I'm gonna finish it. If it really was cheap versus expensive, I would seriously guess that this is like from somewhere good, like a restaurant or something. Yeah, like that. so I typically have only had Beyond Burgers at like high end yeah, restaurants. Yeah, like in Hollywood or LA or something like yeah, that. Yeah, and so now it's nice that you can just like drive through. Oh and my get gosh. One. No, that's, I'm like sad that I know this now because I'm gonna go to Carl's Jr. like once a week probably. <laughs> yeah. And it's yeah. still not great for me because I get large fries, but this is really good. Yeah. I'm, I'm hyped. Sorry for scaring you for yeah, a second. That's fine. But I you got a burger. This. Thanks. The bag was worth it. <laughs> So there you have it. There are some things, especially with the ice cream, where you can tell more of a difference if something is like dairy or vegan. But for the most part, even if people could tell, they still enjoyed it. So I say go try new things, keep an open mind, and enjoy. Bye.